I'm going to try and feed Cyclops for you guys. I don't know, maybe I might make this like a normal thing at the end of each video. I'll show me feeding him, you know. I don't know how this got here, but there's like a little hole here. And I just ploop him in right there. And I'm just going to wait till he notices them or decides to eat them, you know. Shouldn't take too long. I'll, I'll just start recording again once he decides to go in. There you go. He's eating. I messed it a little bit, but he is in fact eating the pellets I put in. Now I try to get him a balanced diet of pellets and you know, the dried mix and uh, fish and worms. Missed it. Hi, yeah. right, Cyclops. Oh, you want camera time, don't you? You want all the camera time, don't you? Go eat. Go eat. No, it's difficult with him only having one good eye because. He can't just see the food very easily. It has to be on a certain side of his face, which is very annoying. Did he get it? Oh, he got it. Oh, and the crayfish is just chilling there. <laughs> crayfish is squaring up. There's a pellet right up there. Now only if he just positions his head just right. He can get it. Or see it. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, come on. Just as he's... Oh, here we go. Maybe, possibly. Come on, look. See it. It's right there. Here we go. Oh, dang, he lost it. He can't get back there. Now, uh, I didn't really say this in my last video, but um, I did leave a little note at the bottom. Uh, this is a rusty crayfish, which they are invasive to Michigan, actually. Um, now, I don't really know. It's somewhat difficult to tell species apart for me. However, I, I, you can tell because of... Uh, the eyes and the tips of their claws. They've got orange and black on the tips of their claws. I don't, yeah, you can see that. Um, oh, what does he got? Oh, he's got something and he's eating it. But uh, I don't even know if I've really ever seen a different species besides this. I probably have, I just don't know. As of lately, no. In the last year, I've seen probably only rusty crayfish. And I also left a note about this, the catfish aquarium. Um, catfish, you know, I labeled them as harmless, which, I mean, they're not aggressive, but most species of catfish have, like, little, uh, like, prickers or spines on the side of their fins, which can uh, penetrate skin. I've... I was fishing once and I caught a decently sized uh, flathead catfish and uh, ooh, I, you know, I knew it, I was grabbing it wrong because there's a certain way you have to grab them and uh, well for some reason I decided not to, uh, not to fix the way I was grabbing it and it, it punctured me hard. It hurt so bad. Here's the coolie loach and the albino cory. Remember, come up with names for these guys. I don't know if, um, I don't know, this is literally the day after I recorded that video, but, uh, and I haven't seen many names 
yet that I like. Um, however, the Julie Cory catfish, where is he? Oh, swimming back there. That thing's name is Nunu. And uh, it's a thing because my aunt's name is Julie, but for some reason, me and my brother and a lot of my relatives that are young have always called her Nunu. So that's Nunu right there. And you know, I'm thinking that one should, or Pepper, cause you know, Pepper and then, cause, cause we're, because he's white, sugar, you know, sugar and pepper, and a pepper and sugar, and a sugar and pepper. It's an honest, honest thing. Pepper and sugar, sugar and pepper, pepper and sugar, sugar and pepper. They're chicken, 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 chicken. They have wings and they don't fly a lot. They like to eat seed and they have sharp talons. Hold me like a chicken. Oh, like a chicken? In my wings. Sugar and pepper and a pepper and sugar and a sugar and pepper. Don't forget to hold your chicken tight. You know, support the wings and sing a little song. Sugar and pepper and a pepper and sugar and a sugar and honest and honest and honest. I haven't come up with a name for the. Oh, geez, he's zooming. But I don't know about a name for the Cooley Loach, the Green Cory. Uh, the that one upside down catfish and yeah all yeah all the rest but um yeah so so far we've got Nunu pepper and sugar and uh, I have not come up with a name for the crayfish wherever it went let's see oh yeah you can see it a little bit oh now it's moving out of frame. There we go. He's getting warm. I'm chewing gum now, but whatever. I'm trying to get a good angle. Ah, uh, no. Go the other way. Mm. You just want camera time, don't you? That's so cool looking. Yes, over there, look. Oh. He likes chilling right there. All right, he might, oh, I think he sees it. Oh yeah. Almost. There we go. I'm just gonna say I take it back. I think that's a poop. So cool. He's got a little piece of it hanging out of his mouth. So yesterday, I showed you guys me feeding Cyclops, and now I'm gonna feed all the catfish. Well, except the upside down catfish and the auto thing. That dude, that's moving around a lot right now. Right there. Um, so what I feed them is um, Appy, AP, at something um, bottom feeder pellets with shrimp they seem to like it so I'm still trying to figure out how much is too much and how much is too little I'm gonna try four pellets all together today here's I think 
one. I don't know where that even went. Two, three, and four. Hopefully they'll notice them soon. Oh, the green cat, green Cory found one. And the albino's getting it. And Nunu's getting it too now. Forgot that I have, I literally just said I have names for them. And I forgot that the albino's name is Sugar. Sugar is getting it now. I really love the diversity in here, um, but also knowing that they're all related. Obviously, um, some are more related than others. Obviously, all the Corys look very related because of the shape of their bodies and everything. But, you know, there's the color diversity, which is just really cool to me. And then the upside down catfish is really cool. And then the auto thing. The coolie loach is by far the most different in here. And I just like that's such a cool fish. I love that. There's other pellets sitting around, guys. You don't have to hog all of those. Or hog that one. Excuse me. I apologize if it's a bit boring. I just don't have much commentary to say. So soon, hopefully, I don't know when, but hopefully soon I can get a panda quarry in here. And, um, I don't know. You know what? I, I just had an idea. I'm going to bring something. Oh, here comes the Otto. Otto, that's his name. You know what? Otto. Not like auto, like like auto insurance or <laughs> something, but just Otto, like a river. No, that that's not the right reference. I don't know. Otto. O-T-T-O. You know that. I think my mom also said that in a comment um, for uh, the last video. So yeah, that's his name, Otto. <clears throat> but, as I was going to say, I used to have a different YouTube channel. I used to be into collecting wrestling figures and whatnot. Um, and uh, I haven't deleted that channel. I just uh, don't upload anymore on it. Um, it's WFE Wrestling Figure Entertainment. You should go subscribe to it, even though I'm probably never gonna do another video on it because I mean like, why not? Just like go subscribe, watch my other videos, you know, just like get, drop a like, you know, D do stuff, be nice, please. I'm going to bring something over from my other YouTube channel, as I was going to say. This is going to be called Therapy Time. I mean, it was called Therapy Time on my other channel, too. But, yeah, Therapy Time. I'm going to be asking you a series of questions, seeing how you're doing today, how life has been, what you got planned. I don't know, stuff like that. So, let's begin. How are you feeling today? Good? That's good. Did you do anything fun this week? Yeah, that is pretty fun. I like doing that too. I'm sorry to hear that. We all go through rough times.
never give up. Everybody has their own struggles. And you just have to keep pushing on and on and on until you one day can achieve what you want to achieve and be happy. Do you have any plans this weekend or upcoming week? No? Oh. Well, maybe you should hang out with some of your friends or, um, I don't know, your family. No, it's always nice to check up on your family and see how they're doing. Yeah, I know. I know. Well, I hope that you start doing better. Mm. <clears throat> okay. Thank you all for watching. If you like this video, please make sure to drop a like, subscribe, leave a comment. Um, I still need some names for these fish. Um, you know, tell your friends about the channel. Share it. They, just, yeah. Thank you.